Huh. It's called a loser. It's called a waste of my money. How's that? People were asking whether you lose in this breaking. Oh, yeah, this is a loser. I have no clue, but. My guess would be no, after what it sold for. <laughs> yeah, trust me. Well, I know I'm out a solid 400. I'm glad I've got one case and one case only. And this is why I don't do teams. Talk about brutal. Oh, yeah. But I make... <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'd love to have a chat with, with that guy right now. <laughs> the one I posted on Facebook. Nope, that won't ever happen. I think this is about as, it's not quite as bad as that leaf crap that I had. But this wasn't good.
I don't do it that often. So every once in a while, we need to come back to genuine star or thing. It's no big deal. Yeah, says my husband with the black eye. You know, boxers can get wrinkles. She got a game against the Jackie and Stewart. Okay, Jackie and Stewart don't give you brain damage. Then you hurt me, okay? Promise me. I'm being my own. You in a rush? You got some hot date? You got you got a date with Bumo later or something? I'm sure he'll wait for you. Well, my thought is one of you two could do better. I'm not sure which. Stuff is our is old school stuff, isn't it? Definitely old school. I'm looking for the bubble gum. I think there's a couple, three or four, maybe three different years. But I'm looking at the back of them, and oh yeah, it's old school. Not a whole lot of talking going on yet. Just you. I guess it's you and me hanging out, Posty. Huh. This is my one and only case. I would have to say probably not by what it sold for. If it was good, it would have gone for a lot more than it did. All right, let's get into it. See what we got. Looks like that's 77. What year is this stuff supposed to be? That's 77. Bader, Coming Attractions, that's 81. F that's 58. 58, 77, and 81. Uh, Eddie Matthews? Oh, Tops, Bo an old Bo Jackson? Hmm. No, I don't think so. The back looks good, but the front doesn't. The front's too shiny. They say there's two autos. Schwarby, number to 175, purple. And if you like the if you like the old school looking cards, a Sandlot, Betram Grover, there it is, Syndergaard. I'm going to guess, there is, I mean, from the looks of it, there's a ton of base. I mean, that's mainly what this stuff looks to be. Base, throwback type stuff. A Harper, tops rookie history. Those things aren't numbered or anything, so. 
Heck, if you're going to put it on hockey, put it on channel 31. <laughs> yeah, there probably is. You guys get to have the fun to dig through it and figure it out. Try put it on 31. We got a re I think it's a re nope, that's just a blue. I thought it was a redemption. We haven't hit an auto yet though. Devers coming attraction. Bobby Dore, blue. That one's number to 25 for Boston. <laughs> I would have thought we would have noticed. I mean, they all have autos on it, but I'm pretty sure I'd be able to tell the difference. It'd be shiny or something. There we go. Adam Kennedy auto. National. Was that who you were looking for, Posty? Adam Kennedy? Pro Bowl's coming attraction. A Timmy Timmons Sandlot. 84 Mattingly. Roberto Clemente. Huh. Don't ask me. He doesn't on the card anyway. An Ozzy Smith autograph card. It is 53 of 99. All Ozzy. That's not bad. It's a nice Padres hit. Nice little Padres hit. I'd buy some of this if I knew I was going to get an Ozzy Smith auto out of it. Yeah, but what? A grand total of three sleeved cards in a box? It's a little tough. You'd expect a little more than that. I mean, you're looking at a $90 box and you sleeve three cards. Kind of rough. Like I said, if you told I'd buy a box if you told me there was gonna be an Aussie in it. That could <laughs> keep in mind, Posty, that could have been our bet the best auto we're gonna to see, too. That could have been the case hit. I can tell you right now, the Padres spot paid for itself. I don't care what the Padres went for. It didn't go for enough to cover that. And there you go. It's nice, nice change. Torres coming attraction for an Ozzie Smith auto. Oh, Tawny.
A Glavin Tops rookie. A Hamilton Ham Porter. I wonder if you're guaranteed a Sandlot Auto in a case. Maya, coming attraction. You ever noticed how far off these guys are, Tops is? They still have him as an Indian. I mean, come on, how long has it been that he got traded? Hey, 82 Ripken. Where's your boy, Lou? Here I am pulling Ripkins. Alex Gordon Gray, number to 99. Have you talked to him at all? Yeah. An Ozzy Smith auto. Huh. Albies. That may get 3-3. Three, three. Sorry, I just heard the score. 5-3. All right. A Rich Aurelia. Rich Aurelia. Man, they've got some massive big names, huh? Rich Aurelia. That's that giant auto everybody was... I mean, what is Rich Aurelia doing these days? How did they find him? A Benny the Jet Rodriguez. I mean, not that I want anybody to take it the wrong way and all, but really? Rich Aurelia's got an auto? <laughs> Ray say, come on now. You could have done they could have done a little better than that. Plenty of old timers that they could have got for this stuff. And a Charles Nagy. Charles Nagy purple. Number to 150. So there's 150 of those out there somewhere. I guess that's better than a Rich Aurelia. I now understand why this stuff isn't going for as much. I definitely understand why I got killed on it. With If that's what you're going to expect out of this stuff. No wonder the Sandlot went for 50 bucks. It's the only stuff that you could chase in this so far. like them to it'd be great if one time they put out a product when it was all mid 80s to early 90s autos you get mcguire you've got barry bonds you've got heck even i'll take bobby bonilla if you're gonna go with bonds um just a bunch of those kind of things huh. nope you get looks to be three hits a case or a box and they're, yeah, Bo Jack. I mean, yeah, there's so many, like King Griffey Jr., Juan Gonzalez, uh, Frank Thomas. All that kind of stuff would be wonderful. 
Yeah, I mean, I'd even take Albert Bell. Palmero. All those guys. Sammy Sosa. You could call it the steroid era. Cards. Smith, coming attractions. I'm probably going to go a little quicker through these things. Not that I wasn't already, but... A Timmy Timmons. Yeah. I don't know if I want to go that far. But I mean, just go after the big, the, a lot of the big names back then. Crawford coming attractions. Gary Sheffield would be another one. Pedro. You could get a Pedro auto in that stuff. I mean, there's plenty of people they could have gotten that were big back then. Andrew Stevenson, 299. Randy, see, that would be a great, great product. Yeah. Frazier. See? Exactly. And they can make the cards their rookie cards, autoed rookies type of thing. Wow. Who is Homer Bush? I mean, that's taking our what we're thinking about right now and taking it to the extreme. Homer Bush. I mean, they just called our bluff, and this is what they would do if they did it. That's scary. Homer Bush? Wow. Mike Squints. We got Squints. No, he's a couple removed from Brian Taylor. He's not the guy after. Well, there you go. Who signed it, though? <laughs> Anduhar, coming attractions. The Jet again. Ahmed Rosario. Purple to 175. There you go, Posty. You got your med purple. Congrats. And a Luis Castillo. Luis Castillo. Wow. You know what? I when I said that Ozzy Smith might be the might be the shining star in this case. Wow. At no point did I think it was that shiny a star. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Is it on... Dick's web is it Dick's website where you can order a uh what is it the flux capacitor? I know on one website there's a website you can order a flux capacitor. Might have been Dick's. Oh, uh, see, here we go. We're in the middle of a case like this. I've got you.
Uh, it might have been. It might not have been. It might have been a uh, sports authority or something. Ah. Oh come on! You hit a who? If you had the Marlins, you hit a Luis Castillo. I mean, seriously. How could you be upset after that pull? <laughs> and yet he's still autographing product for tops. He might be working there. Well, you have to admit, there is no way in God's green earth would you have thought I was going to pull a Luis Castillo auto tonight. Or heck, half of the names I've pulled wouldn't have... I mean, I could have given you a, a full spreadsheet to pick out names. You wouldn't have hit most of them tonight. Oh, no, you can't read the checklist in something like this. That'd be faking. That'd be cheating. Hoskins, coming attraction. A Frank Thomas tops rookie history. And no, there's no way those are buybacks. One, they look too clean. Hercules. Hey, you could hit something. I mean, you hit. You could hit something. Jack Morris, blue, number to twenty-five for Black Jack Morris. Hey, you you could hit an old timer Met. I think I liked your price better than what I paid for the raise tonight. Fowler coming attraction. Is that McGuire? It was. I am pretty sure when it comes to the Rays tonight, I got screwed. A Robin Yout. I actually have that card. Somewhere or another. And an Eddie Murray purple to 175. Of course, Austin Meadows is a pirate in this. Rosario coming attraction. What are you booming? What did I what did I hit, Ed? Tyler Glasnow, yet another pirate that isn't. You got the pirates? Machado, what's Machado? He's an Oriole, of course. Who the heck is that? Yangervis Solarte? <laughs> Might be. And a Ray Fosse. Oh, yeah. A Ray Fosse for the Indians. It's not even numbered. I don't know. You tell me. Does that not say Ray Fosse? I had someone tell me this stuff was a bunch of crap. They weren't kidding. Tommy Timmons. I'm telling you, the Sandlot was the purchase out of this stuff. You happen to hit a Sandlot auto. Scotty Smalls. I already had the case. There's, I mean, you have to order this stuff like four months in advance. I'm just glad I only got one case of it. This will be a one and done. And here we go, guys. 
<laughs> no, Dave, but look looking at the looking at what they're what, what we've pulled so far, you've got the right right idea in this stuff. <laughs> Pat Nishek. Pat Nishek. I don't know. Was there an angel? If it, it let's put it this way. If I hit somebody, it wasn't somebody you wanted, Dave. <laughs> How's that? Uh, tell you what, I'll go back through it all. <laughs> We've got Pat Nishak, Ray Fosse. Let me know, Dave, when you when you recognize somebody. Jack Morris numbered card. That's that's a that's a winner. Uh, Luis Castillo, solid. A Homer Bush. Yeah, I didn't even remember good old Homer Bush. Andrew Stevenson numbered. Charles Nagy, I've heard of Nagy. Um, Rich Aurelia. Rich Aurelia. That's a big one. Well, the one I'm going to put at the bottom. Oh, you did hit. Adam Kennedy. I know that's who you were looking for, Dave. Adam Kennedy. You got an angel hit. A Bobby Door. Now, we did hit one good one so far. I will say that. We did hit an Ozzy Smith. We did hit an Ozzy Smith, so that's a nice one. But I'm sure you wouldn't give it up for Adam Kennedy. I mean, you you, you hit the you hit what you were looking for. Ha! I know where you're at, Dave. I got gotcha. you. <laughs> you got to have fun with this kind of product. I will say this. And I'll say it, I, and I've already said it a couple times. The Sandlot was the purchase. No, you remember that comment of, when I do bad, you guys have to chip in a little more? <laughs> you guys all have to chip in an extra 20 <laughs> to make me feel better. Like I said, I paid I paid four for the raise. I think I got screwed. Really? Two of them in one case? Yeah, like I said, if you were to get two of them, that would de I mean, you saw what I hit. I would gamble on the Sandlot in a heartbeat right now if I was going to buy into this stuff. Well, it is an average. Oh. Yeah, the Ozzy Smith was like the second auto, Dave. Um, I made the comment that might have been the the case hit. Little did I know. Wow. Now I'm just curious as to, am I going to know any of the rest of these autos? All right, we're going to fly through. I know you all want to be here for the base, but a Reggie rookie history. <laughs> hey. A Windy Peppercorn. Windy Peppercorn. A Paul De Jong purple to 175. Yeah, there'll be an Otani base. <laughs> non auto. I might actually buy a set of the stinking Sandlot cards. There's your Otani. Jim Palmer rookie. Hey, a peppercorn and an Otani. The same stink inside of a half a box. You're killing it. For this stuff, you are smoking it. Carlton Pudge. Fisk. Numbered to 99. There's our numbered card.
The positive is I'm not losing a whole lot of money on top loaders on this stuff. You break it. You go, going anywhere else tonight, Posty? Any more breaks going on? You might want to buy into something else. Get this at, taste out of your mouth. A Michael Lewis. I think it says no. They told him to autograph it. He just wrote no. Among the New Orleans natives, most acclaimed sports offerings are Moneyball and the Blind Side. Michael Lewis. Author of The Blind Side. No. Nope. It's an author. Wow. Huh. A ham porter. Huh. I don't think I can get four for that one, though. I don't think. The house is still taking, a, take, taking it in the shorts. Tommy Timmons. Hey, I'm rooting. I am rooting for a Sandlot Auto. You got that going for you. <laughs> hey, at least four bucks is better than what you'd probably end up for Tom Browning. The Reds come through. Good old Tom Browning. I hope so. If nothing else, it looks like you're going to end up with 30 or 40 cards if you don't hit an auto. Looks like each box has three or four. I don't know how many cards are in the set. Yeah, I know, Posty. You were kind of, kind of wishing that Tom Browning had been yours. Admit it. Liking this stuff? It should be easy to sort. The names are bold and right there on you. You looking for Hojo, huh? Nah, Hojo is way too famous for this stuff. You're going to have to go obscure Met. Pick a 1983 obscure Met. <laughs> yeah. And I was hitting... Pretty much an Akuna Auto in Elite Extra Edition. Almost one per every half case of cards. Open up a half case and I almost always hit one. This isn't going to be Elite Extra Edition. <laughs> I just want to know who's sitting around a table saying, Hey guys, archives, throw out some names. For autos, and you're gonna get Browning and Michael Lewis and Pat Neshek and Ray Fossey. Denny Nagel, there's a name. Blast from good old blast from the past. Mar see, I see you guys could do this. 
You guys can sit around and come up with the same type of names. I think you guys are a little higher class, though. You're going a little too high. They've got to almost be where you just barely remember them. Kershaw, rookie. No. Terry Pendleton, people remember. A Kenny De Nunez. De Nunez. I am looking forward to seeing all those type of cards. Wade Boggs, purple. Number to 175, Red Sox. That should be a raise. Should Otis Nixon. That's closer. That's, that's almost obscure enough. Hey, Ozzie Smith, top rookie. Charlie Liebrandt. There we go. Ginger's coming through. <laughs> She's hitting some names. Or he's hitting some names. Whatever Ginger may be. I don't want to be. Ah, Mickey Morandini. Yeah, there we go. He could be in this. There you go. Mickey Morandini could be in this. I don't want to paint Ginger into a corner. Oh! you! I'm going to put that on top. Oh! Dave! Dave! Wake up, Dave! <laughs> hey, like I said, who am I to judge? <laughs> oh, Tony. Hey, wake up, Dave! Getting to be a... Yeah, I saw good news. I don't know if it's the one you wanted, but I, you got something coming. And I can just fly through this stuff and not even look at it almost. Hey, guys, you got cards coming. <laughs> All right. It is Beatrum Grover Weeks. Perhaps the most mysterious member of the Sandlot squad. You got weeks. Well, this kind of this one kind of stayed with the with the theme. The obscure Sandlot guy. <laughs> to go with Tom Browning, you go what you gotta get the obscure guy. A yeah yeah McLennan. Is it? Weeks is a 25 to 30? There he is again, Weeks. Nah, see, Steve Avery, I know way too. I mean, that's, that's way. That's way, way too well known. Jose Meza. There you go. See, that's what you're looking for, guys. Jose Meza. You guys should have named that one. The Indians are killing it, though. On Obscure Auto Tuesday, the Indians are killing it. Got to go back. Indians. There was another one in here. Could have sworn there was another Indian. That's it. Ray Fossey was the other Indian. See, I can't even remember that far back. You're an Indian fan. Mesa and Fossey. Come on now. Those are what you were hoping to pull. Oh, Sid Breen. Ah, oh, what's the pitcher for the... What's Maybe, you, maybe somebody remember. Pitcher for the Pirates, who I'm pretty sure ended up being an announcer. Who got where he couldn't throw a strike. He got the yips, couldn't throw a strike, and ended up having to retire. And became an announcer for the Pirates. Somebody's going to pull it out. No, for the Pirates, not the Cardinals. Same concept. I don't think you spilled Ann Keel right, though. No, not Doug Drabeck. You say it, I'll remember it. 
Somebody Google pirates with the yips. Is back in like the 70s. And then he became an announcer. No, not no, he just talks that way. Steve Blass. Steve Blass. He would fit. You guys really never heard of Steve Blass? Hey, you can't be naming Mets. That's too easy for you. Seriously, Google Pirates pitcher with the yips. First thing that comes up is Steve Glass. Five worst case of yips in baseball. And he was, he helped them win a World Series too. And then he just lost it. I mean, he went all Ann Keel way before Ann Keel did. Well, there's a bunch of Otanis in this. Al Oliver auto coming. There you go. Oh, Lightning scored again. A Piazza rookie. Six to three Lightning. I know. Posey's sitting there. Benny the Jet again. Like the third or fourth Benny the Jet. Uh, Jeter to 175. Bueller, Bueller, Bueller. Well, it's six to three. I think they've only lost one game so far this year, too. Chipper, rookie. Man, Posey looks old. <laughs> Didn't I mention this before? Who the heck this guy is? Yang, Yang Jervis Solarte, number to 99, solid card. He actually plays for the Padres. Wow. But it shows him in a Blue Jay uniform, and everything on here says Padres. Well, you guys have played more games than the Lightning right now. Said, I'm pretty sure the Lightning have only lost one. I think the Lightning are just going to try to cruise and not get hurt. Flaherty coming attraction. We got a purple, Adam Kennedy, number two. Oh, yeah, baby. Number to 150. Oh, yeah. Where's the other one? We're going for the rainbow, buddy. We. Oh, yeah. We're going for the rainbow. Oh, that Dave's killing it. <laughs> Timmy Timmons. Dave is just smoking this case. A ham porter. I told you the Sandlot is the way to go in this stuff. There is no doubt in my mind. Sandlot should have gone for about three hundred bucks.
Yeah, it crashed again. It's what it does best. I did hold out to Phil Gardner, though. Come on now, Phil Gardner. Give it up. Look at that mustache, too. No. There's an unlimited amount of those. That mustache is for everybody. <laughs> I, I, I'm surprised I said, Ed. I mean, I understand they were sitting around a table thinking up names, but... Well, the only thing that would the only thing that makes sense to me, Ed, is that half these guys are warehouse guys. They all work for tops in a warehouse somewhere. Hey Phil, you wanna make an extra couple bucks? Ah nah. They're a little higher end than they they Nah. Forklifts. They're running the forklifts. Phil Garner looks more like a forklift kind of guy, I'm telling you. Well, I hate to say this, guys. We're down to three boxes left. Only six more autos of this product. <laughs> hey, Post, did this make you feel a little bit better about Bowman Chrome? Holy crap, lightning score again? Did they pull the goalie? That's three goals in the last, like, 30 seconds. It's now eight to three. I think the Devils pulled the goalie. Yeah, this makes you feel like Bowman Chrome isn't so bad. I mean, seriously. It's like in, it's like in pitching. In the in ninth inning, they put in a like an outfielder to pitch. Did they bring in like a forward to play goalie? That makes sense. I don't want to waste the goalie. Bring in a forward. Hoskins, somebody on the bench that doesn't get to play much. Let's see what he can do. A Mike Trout tops rookie history. Too bad it's not a real Mike Trout rookie. That would have livened this up a little bit. You got another week's. Huh. The Lightning trailed 2 0, too, they're saying. They're on an 8 1, to, eight to one run. Well, I'm thinking he's proven he's not ready for game speed quite yet. <laughs> Al Kaline, rookie history. You didn't have to add D. You could have just said they aren't playing. And a purple Zach Granke, number to 175. He looks happy. I've got a buddy at the game tonight. I wonder if he's going to leave early. <laughs> I wonder if he's already left. We got a fight in the goal. Hold on. Got to look. They are actually fighting inside the net. Huh. Sorry, guys. This stuff just isn't holding my attention the way it should. 
They start yelling fight, you kind of got to look. <laughs> oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, come on now, Posey. This is just funny. I think Adam Kennedy got hurt. That's just crazy. Sorry, I, we were going for the rainbow. We doubled up. We didn't hit another. We hit two base. My bad. <laughs> Way to go, Tops. Hey, Dave, you're cornering the market, that's for sure. The Nunez. Yeah, there you go, Posty. That would do it. Man, am I glad I got one case of this crap, and that is it. A Squints Paladoris. <laughs> hey, Dave, if I told you you were going to have four autos, I'm pretty sure you wouldn't have guessed the four you ended up with. <laughs> All right, there you go, Posty. You wanted one. There you go. Who's that guy? You're up, Posty. Your, your boy is here. Who is Felix Milan? Could have been. There you go. Now that does that could be the guy from Brewster's Millions. It says it's a fan favorite. Which fan was his? <laughs> I'm sorry, but it does say fan favorite. So which fan was this his favorite? Well, yeah, where's John tonight? John would love this stuff. John would be having a whole... <laughs> yeah, this... This... I don't know what to tell you. I'm going to have to go back with the whole... I don't pack them, Steve. Hey, look at it this way. I paid 400 for the raise. <laughs> uh... Really? I keep trying to explain. I'm pretty darn sure the Ozzy Smith was the, the thing you wanted to hit. If you missed out on Ozzy, you're screwed. I don't think they got to be. <laughs> wow. This recap is going to be great. I'm going to have to lead with the Ozzy Smith to keep people's attention on the recap. If I don't lead with the Ozzy Smith, people are going to bail halfway through. <laughs> See, Ed's trying to bail before we even get there. Who do you have, Ed? What team do you have or have if you've got multiples? There could be a Felix Milan in your future. Well, we know it won't be Ripken. It won't even be Palmero. <laughs> that is true. It won't be an Eddie Muriato. We won't go that far. Does Cal and Billy have a brother that could have signed? Because Billy would be way too much, too. But if they had an obscure brother that might have signed? Like Fred Ripken? That's probably too big a name, too.
a schmaltzy rookie. Oh, it's working. It's working. Someone type in. It's working. Tommy Timmons. You guys are hearing me plenty good. Oh, Rafi Devers, purple. 175. Crawford. This is a nasty stuff. Brooks Robinson. There you go, Ed. Brooks. Dave Winfield. Hey, you did hit an 82 Ripken, too. You got that going for you. That 82 Ripken re is probably better than anything you would have hit auto-wise. <laughs> you got... You got to think, the 82 Ripken's got to be better than any of the autos that you might have hit. Frazier. And a blue, Brian Dozier. Number to 25. Oh, yeah, and this is actual paper, guys. This is actual paper with Christmas coming up. This is good fire starter. I do have you there. Soak this stuff in some lighter fluid. I mean, we're talking solid. Oh, Chris Davis. Killing. Ha, I almost passed it. Hector Lopez. Yeah, that guy. Huh. Uh, elite 2018 elite. <laughs> Richard really is looking pretty darn good right now, isn't it, Brad? Admit it. Uh, 2018 elite comes out on the 5th, same day as draft, December 5th. Ah, uh, Wendy Peppercorn. Yep, same day as draft. I'm hoping to get about 20 cases of it in. Anduhar. I do like Elite, and it's got Wander Franco, so I'll be all about that. Hercules. Ha! <laughs> uh, I saw the green, and I'm like, Ichiro, we hit it. No, of course not. The one green we actually hit, and it's not an auto. Uh, I got excited there thinking we hit Ichiro. Hey, we did hit a Tommy Glavin. That goes with the Ozzy Smith. For everything we've hit, that's absolutely a stellar hit right there, folks. Tom Glavin. So I don't know what do I lead with now in the recap. Do I lead with Tommy or do I lead with Ozzy? <laughs> Thanks, Posty. Yeah, I know. It's not necessarily who the Braves thought they were looking for, but hey, after looking at the rest of this stuff, I'd be thrilled if I had the Braves and I ended up with Tommy. I mean, he's way too big a name to have signed in this. I, uh, all right, guys. I apologize, but I've only got one more box. We've only got two more autos left. Well, the the thing that's important about this is, like I said, it is making Bowman Chrome look great. I won't be whining about Bowman Chrome's pain for a little while. Oh. <laughs> uh. I don't 
know. I think tomorrow might be a little too soon to be complaining about it again. I could have a, maybe a monitor in back running this stuff in the background so you can watch and can kind of compare Bowman Chrome to archives. MLB stars in classic tops designs. They never mention the stars are autoed on you know, the Jumbotron. The lightning really playing our if you're happy and you know it. Well, I guess it is eight to three. There should be happy and you should know it. All right, folks. Here is your last chance at Obscure Auto Tuesday. Last box. Torres coming attraction. We do have a Mattingly rookie, fake, Scotty Smalls, a Bob Gibson blue, number to 25. Hey, for a Cardinals hit, that's not too bad for a Cardinals. Low numbered Bob Gibson. Maybe this is going to be the box of all studs. <laughs> well, if this was your first break ever, a Willie McCovey rookie history, this might scare you away for good if this was your first break ever. Oh, wow. This took over an hour to do, too. It's an hour's worth of pain. All right, guys. Huh. Trust me. This is, this is not what you want to put out there in your video of why you want to get into breaks and buy baseball cards. A Jeter. I got a bunch of those somewhere. I'm talking the real ones. Okay, folks. Oh, I got a couple of sand lots in there. Maybe one of them's autoed. Because, as we all know, he hasn't hit enough autos. Nope. Willie Wilson. Eh, obscure Royal. That's. Eh, I could live with Willie Wilson. I'd give I'd put 250 for that. It might be worth 250. Well, they don't specify who the fan was. Hercules. Oh, Tony. Yeah, yeah, McLennan. One last obscurity, guys. I see blue back there. Schmaltzy would have been a good one to go with. And it is an auto. A blue auto. All right, folks. Behind the Hunter Pence, we've got a blue. Obscure Tuesday auto. And, oh yeah, it's going to be obscure. Look at that. We've got a Marlin hit, guys. Marlin hit number two. Can anybody name the Marlin? I don't think you'll get it. Any guesses? 
It's not a repeat. Charles Johnson. Because that is a fan favorite. <laughs> 13 of 25. Low numbered Charles Johnson. That brings that value up to a buck and a quarter. Whammo. All right, guys, guess what? I am going to do a recap because I can. That's got to go. We got to lead off with that. I'm going to have to lead off with that one. We got to get our Kennedys together. Some important stuff, folks. Eh, weeks. We'll be down at the bottom. And eh, we'll throw him in the middle. Finish off with that one. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. Recap from archives. I apologize in advance, but I took it way worse than you did. So look at it that way. <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. You're funny, Steve. All right. Our silvers, number to 99. We've got Stevenson, Fisk, Solarte, Gordon, Blues to 25, Door, Morris, Dozier, and Gibson. Autos. We're going to start off with a good one, and then we're going to break into our obscurity. We did hit a Tommy Glavin for the Braves. Hey, Atlanta, be glad you hit that one. All right, we've got Willie Wilson. Charles Johnson, number to 25. Hector Lopez. I know that's who you guys were looking for. The giant hit of the night, Rich Aurelia. Boom. Giant, I'm telling you. He's a giant. Indians hit Nagy. Yankees came back with Homer Bush. I mean, seriously, you got Hector Lopez and Homer Bush. What more could you want? Our Marlins, we hit Luis Castillo. Pat Neshek for the Phillies. Then we hit an author, Michael Lewis. He didn't even want to autograph it. He just wrote no on it. For the Reds, Tom Browning. Tom Browning. Indians came back with Jose Mesa. Obscure reliever Tuesday. And then Ray Fosse, Foss, whatever it may be, catcher for the Indians. I've got no clue who that dude is. Never heard of him. Not once. I have heard of Phil Gardner. We do have Phil Gardner. Adam Kennedy. Okay, folks. We are going to start off with our Adam Kennedys. Because he obviously signed a million. Because we hit Adam Kennedy. Yeah, we hit another one. Two wasn't enough. In 24 autos, let's hit three. No, we didn't hit a fourth. We did hit Felix Milan, though. Felix Milan for the Mets. Posty just about lost it. I mean, he's been wanting one of these for like 20 years. Felix Milan. Our Sandlot Auto. Bertram Grover, Weeks. Weeks. Hit an we got an obscure Sandlot guy, even. And then the hit of the case. Ozzy Smith. Is Fosse the guy that got ran over by Pete Rose in the All-Star game? Ozzy Smith. Nice little Ozzy. The actual hit of the night. Hey, I learned something tonight. If that is true, there you go. Way to go, Howie. Way to bring some knowledge. Fosse is the guy that got smoked by Pete Rose. All right, guys. Well, after tonight, I'm sure you guys will be thrilled to hear. We're back to Bowman Chrome tomorrow. <laughs> Absolutely, Steve. <laughs> we got Hobby on Wednesday. Two cases of HTA on Thursday and Hobby on Friday. We'll be doing a lot more Bowman Chrome between now and December 5th. 
All right, guys. Hope you had a good one. I will catch you tomorrow night.